Uh, you know what, I've been really impressed um, top to bottom, just um, their football uh, intellect and what they know, and, and uh, they've been coached before. You know, Coach Sturdy did a great job with those kids, and they're into it and really eager to, uh, to do well this year and, and I think uh, make a statement. You know, it's a young group for the most part, and, um, you know, they're, they're, they're eager. Uh, you know what, I, we talk about consistency. You know, that's, uh, that's the thing that probably every coach will talk about is, is consistency. You know, you have kids come in that are really good one day, and then the next day you're not sure about them. And, uh, you know, if they can come in and give you, give you consistency, you, you have a baseline for them. You know, I, I can't go off a kid who, who's one day great and one day okay. You know, um, if, if he's okay every day, at least I know what I'm getting. You know, it's been good. Um, you know, no different than any other time I've been around them. And, uh, I think we look for look at each other for for ideas and and for um, you know just just knowing each other. You know, it's easy to to understand what he wants and what he expects. And being around him for so many years in the in the workplace and and noticing what he does, uh, I I know what he wants. You know, and I think I can help some of the other guys uh, when they're have when they have questions and things like that. So it's been good. Yeah, I did. I I was kind of a junkie as a kid and. Um, Every chance I got, I could go to practice, and uh, it was just, it's all I knew. Uh, you know, when Dad was at work, he was at work, and when he was home, he was home, and when he was at work, we tried to be there with him. So uh, I was there a lot, uh, and, and more so in my high school years when I wasn't playing. Um, I tried to go over as often as I could, but it was just, uh, it, it's fun. It's, it, you don't feel like you go to work every day. It's not really work. Um, I think that they have, for being young guys, they have a lot of experience. Uh, you know, they're only having one senior, but really they've all played quite a bit. Uh, and I think it's going to help them a lot uh, throughout their latter years here at Iowa State. I, you know, there's no doubt. Um, you know, Quentin's played a lot of ball, and, mm -hmm. and Dondre's played a lot of ball, and, uh, you know, obviously Jarvis has too. And, and uh, you know, they've had, they've had some experience for a young group. I, I told him this uh, to his face. He's got to be consistent. You know, he's got to be a playmaker. People are going to know about him, uh, and people are going to do things to take him away uh, because he's been a, been a playmaker for us. Uh, and, and I told him he's got to be consistent, he's got to be physical, and he's got to bring his A game every day. Uh, and he does. He's a focused kid, and uh, it's awesome to coach him. You know, he loves to catch the football, but he, he'll go out there and block you too. I mean, he's not scared. Jarvis has been great. You know, he's been a leader of our group. He's, he's not a, a hoorah, you know, hoopla guy, and, and I'm okay with that because I'm not either. I'm not a run around and cheerlead kind of guy. Uh, he just kind of leads by example, and, and uh, I appreciate what he brings to the table because he's very mature. Uh, he's, a, he's an extremely mature kid, and he's fun to be around.